welcome back to Ultimate Arc Dossier Collection Sack. Yeah. <laughs> right, in this one we're going to be doing, um, we're going to be covering the grad students. The Dionys, the question marks, we've already got the Santiago, we've got all the dossiers on that, we've got the Guardian, and we're going to be focusing on So this is what we're covering in this section, so if you need any of them, I uh, will be doing them in order, like from one to the end, and then one to the end, we've got these. Um, these are obviously when you start aberration and then you beat aberration. Uh, 1 to 15, and then the ones that are available on this map will be good. Okay, so first up, we're going to be starting with Emilia. Emilia. We're going to be starting with Rusty, number one. Alright, so these, these ones look a little bit weirder um, because. They're like little backpacks. So this is your first one. Uh, it's a grad student, Rusty, and it's at 38.4 by 51.5. Okay, the next one is here. Just, make, just making sure it's safe to uh, jump off in it. Alright, there we go. Rusty number two and it's at 34.1 by 50.5 um but this next one is just hit and it's at 31 by 47.8 all right this is the next one coming up it's just hit this is rusty number four and it's at 37 by 41 so okay this is your next one should be around here yeah, there it is, just that. Okay. This is your rusty number 5 and it's at 45.5 by 38 on the nuts. Uh, I believe that's all of the rusty ones. Yeah. Okay, we're now going to work on Emilia 1 to 5. So if you need one of these, watch this segment. Okay, so this is your first one. It's Emilia, she had a green backpack. Okay, so that is at 46.1 by 35.3. Okay, this is Emilia number 2. And it is at 39.1 by 37.3. Right, so number 3 is in the blue bar. Make sure it's safe, okay. There's number three, and it's at 56.1 by 38.4. Right, number four is just here. Uh, at the bottom of the base of the tree, um, the base is over that location, so the opposite side to my base. And this is your number four dossier, and it's at 48.7 by 63.7. This is your Emilia number 5. Right by the entrance there. And that's at 24.3 by 65.5. Emilia number 5. Um, literally by the surface entrance to when we come up. Right here. Uh, let me just come up. Okay, so that's Emilia number 5. Next is the Boris slot, and that is normally situated around about the west to centre of the map. So I'll see you at the first one. Bit difficult to see, but it's right here. This this is your Boris number one, normally where the beehives are. Uh, for if you want to tame the roll rats. Okay, and that is at 44 by 25 points. 
this is your second one. So anyway, this is your number two. And it's at 55.7 by 52 foot. Uh, this one's in the uh, radiation zone. Just underneath the pillar on the way out. It's this little bag here. And it's 63.7 by 48.9. Uh, number four, it's at 55.6, 51 four. So I'm going to get the fuck out of here. Okay, this one is Boris number five. A bit hard to see. <laughs> I found this one just walking over it. Um, but there it is, 52.6 by 40.5. Okay. Alright, your next lot's going to be your Trent one to five. Okay, this is your first one. Uh, you've got a yellow rucksack this time, and it's 58.5 by 37. Okay, and it's Trent number 2, and it's at 70.9 by 49.1. Trent, journal number 2. Okay, this is number 3 coming up. Seeing relatively okay. Alright, number 3 is at 69.7 by 55.6. Okay, this is number four, and it's just it. You know how dangerous this place is, motherfucker. Alright, it's at 78, 71.8 by 61.6. Okay, this is Trent number five. And it's at 77.1 by 68.1. Okay. The next one, next lot is the Imamu, I believe it is. So we'll do the Imamu 1 to 5, and then we've got Sky, and it's only 1. Plus we have a level, which is awesome. Uh, that is the Tech Phase Pistol, we won't be making it on this map, um, no need for it. There it is, Tech Phase Pistol, drop that. Right, so this is your Trent number one. Just make sure it's safe. Your Manu, sorry, uh, number one. That's at 75, 73, 75.3 by 73.5. This is uh, your next one. Uh, this is Manu number two. So it's 68.7 by 72.5. Okay, number three is over here somewhere, like that. Uh, just make sure it's safe before you jump off. Uh, there's number three, it's 72.7 by 62.8. Alright, this is your number four, just hit. Uh, and it's at 71.9 by 55.1. Imanu number 4. Okay, this is Imanu number 5. It's uh, literally by the uh, like boss portal. Right at the bottom, the Giga Skeleton, basically. Okay. That's at 46.4 by 48.6. Alright, and then we've got the Sky, which I'll bring back for. There's only one of these. So for some reason, there's only one of these Skies. And this is, this is it here. And that's at 45.4 by 40.5. Okay, I shall meet you back at base. So yeah, that's the that's the kids' journals uh, that got you uh, killed on the lot. Right, so we have the Diana logs to do. The question marks. 
these are obviously spread across all maps. Um, so basically, as you can see, there they're all in order. So there's only a few. There's only a few of them to get on this on this map. So if I take that, the islands ones, uh, scorched earth ones. And then obviously we've got Genesis, There's none of them on Genesis. Right, so, we've got a, got a few of them here to get. I think there's about two of them question marks on this map. Um, we've got all of these, there is, we've got the Santiago one. Um, if you've never seen the Santiago, that's the Santiago dossier. And we've got all of them. Guardians, obviously, got. Elena's what we're after next. Okay. So the next lot is the Diana log. Um, some of these are on the surface, so we you know, wait until sort of night time before we head over there um, and go from there. But we're going to do we're going to do that sec that section now. So if you want the Dianas. Uh, stick around for this section. Okay, this is your first one. This is your Diana log number one. And it's at 47.5 by 31.9. Uh, yeah, I think number num I think number 10 and 11 is on the surface. Uh, that's number two. Okay, that's at 29.7 by 52.5. Okay, here's number three. Okay, Diana number three, and it's at 33.7 by 47.3. Uh, this is your Diana note number four. And that is at 37.6 by 46 on the note. So this is your number 5, right next to the vine that swings across. Just up from the riverbed. Right. And this is at 30.5 by 45.6. Okay, number 6. time for this. Okay, this is number 6 and it's at 33.9 by 38.8. Right, so as I say, this is number 7 and it's at 38.3 by 37 on the note. Okay, this is number 8 and it's at 38.1 by 29.6. Right, it should be around here somewhere. There it is, okay. Right, there we go. We have your Diana number 9, and it's at 48.2 by 23.3. Right. Okay, so this is your Diana. I'll shut away from the surface. There's the uh, entrance. And this is your Diana number 10, and it's at 18.7. Or 69 on the nose. Uh, we are right by the obvious. And this is your Diana, and it's 22.2 .2 by 78.4. Number 11. Okay, number. Okay, number 12 is in the blue bar. Here we go, number 12. And we're at 58.2 by 61.3. Uh, 52.9 by 
Okay, this is number 14. Just keeping an eye on that mega horse over there. And this is at 47.3 by 72.2. Okay, here's number 15. Just making sure we're okay. Number 15, and that's at 52.8 by 76.4. As you can tell, we're in the hazard zone. And this is number 16, and it's at 70.4 by 75.3. Okay, here's number 17. That's at 84.5 by 77.5. Well, this is number 18, and it's at 70.5 by 73.6. Okay, this is number 19, and it's at 70.9 by 58.9. Okay, the last one for Diana coming up. Alright, here we go. This is number 20. Number 20 is at 60.5 by 47.6. Okay, there we go. There's all 20 of them. Next up is next up is the last four question marks. So we'll crack on with that. That's the next segment coming up. So triple question mark six, triple question mark nine, triple question mark twelve, and triple question mark fifteen coming up in this segment. Right, there it is down there. This one always confused me. Okay. And this is your Explorer Note triple question mark number 6 and it's at 29.4 by 58.4. This one's a little trickier to get. Right, here we go. This is your uh, triple question mark uh, number nine. That's at forty-seven point five by twenty-one point seven. That's forty-seven point five, twenty-one point seven. Well, by the portal, just before you go in the entrance, you'll see it. Right. So this is your next one, basically. Let me uh, just get over here. Alright, you really don't want to be doing this on an earthquake. So, this is your explorer note number 12. Did you get that one? Alright. Uh, basically, it is the. Just trying to find you a better view of it. It's the pillar going all the way down with no structural support. So if you aim for the river and then sort of try and work your way back out, it's over there. Alright, let me uh, let me try and get a some calls for it. Alright, the calls to this is sixty nine on the nose, forty six point three, and that is your number twelve question mark. Mm 
This here is your. Oh, I need to try and rainbow my way around. Right, let's, let's, let's pull it there. That's good. Right, this is your number 15. I got it when I landed. 80, 84.9 by 69.8. You can't miss it. So we've now got all the question marks. Lovely. Guardians down. So we just need the chronicles. I believe. Yeah, I believe that we are a good one. Right. These ones are fairly easy to find. They're dotted around the map. Right, there's your first one. Here you two are. Still on a tour of all the old haunts? Well, this place was pivotal, I'll grant you that. This is where I made myself a god, after all. Alright, uh, that's your first one, that's number 11, and that is at 13.9 by 43.2. Uh, should be around here somewhere. I wonder, has this puppet told you anything about its creator? I never understood Ms. Walker's affinity for the creatures on these arcs. Now that I'm creating beasts of my own, I admit, I'm learning the appeal. So that's your chronicles. Don't get it, don't get it confused, that's your your chronicles we're doing first. Okay, and then obviously number 13 will do again. So we'll see you at number 13. You see your next one? It is amusing to realize now we were never more than patterns to those future people. They recorded us in their big book of recipes, then selected each of us at random to grow in their vats. Ran us through their mazes, with an eye toward any useful survival skills. Evolve or die. Well, I surely exceeded their expectations. Alright, that's your number 13. And that is at the Rockwell Terminal. At 42.8 by 36.5. Alright, so we want to head over there. Alright, there we go. You should know that I'm well aware, Mr. Purple Tentacles has been talking for me. I'm working with the minute to that. Not to worry. I've just got a few million more dark sockets to encrypt, and then he should be locked out for good. Estimated time to complete? Um, better I don't say. Alright, so as you can see, that is literally just opposite the cave entrance in the shadows. Okay. And that is your number 14, I believe. I want to say. Yeah, that's your 14. So we're going to be going to do the discovery section now. Alright, so I'll see you in a bit. Alright, this is your next one, just literally at the bottom of my place. on the verge of collapse. There's radiation, mutant creatures, toxic gas, earthquakes. Not the lush paradise that's supposed to be here. I'm not sure how to put this, but... Uh... We didn't do this, did we? 
I mean, I've seen you survivors mow through berry bushes and chop through entire forests. But trash an entire ark? That's another level. And if you did trash this place? Don't tell me. Best I don't know. Alright, that's your Helena discovery number eight. Alright, now time for number ten. Uh, sorry, nine. So I'll see you at number nine. My scanners are showing element all over the place. Be careful with that stuff. Why? Two reasons. First, I've seen how Element can transform critters from a Moppet to a Menace. We have creatures in the Genesis simulation that go crazy for the stuff. Second, Element gets into a survivor's mind too. Helena, my creator, knew a survivor who couldn't get enough Element. Drove him stark raving mad it did. Um, I think that's the little fucking... The Ferox on Genesis that's addicted to it. Right, but anyway, that's your number 9 uh, Helena thing, and that's at 68 2 by 65 9. I don't understand how you live with the danger all the time. Every shadowy corner or dark cave here is something lurking. Usually something that wants to eat you. I wish I could help, but Helena didn't exactly kit me out for combat. No grenade launchers or anything like that. She didn't even give me limbs to hold a weapon. All I've got is short-range scanners, diagnostic software, and a charming personality. Oh, and an extensive library of Australian vulgarities. I wonder when that'll become relevant. <laughs> Alright, so that's your number 10. So we're going to now go and get number 11. It's on the surface, this one. So it'll be a few minutes. Alright, it should be over. There we go. I might grab this loot block as well. The background levels of element are way higher on this arc. I wonder whether that was part of the plan. To see what the survivors would do with element if you had access to it. Or maybe... Maybe it's the reverse. The plan was to see what Element would do if it had access to survivors. That's the thing about Element. It adapts to whatever it's in contact with. If you aren't careful, Element can corrupt you. But I know you'll be careful. After all, we made it this far, huh? Alright, so that is every single dossier on Aberration. Um, so that's that one. I don't think I showed um, the Santiago dossier, how to get it. So I'll meet you at the Santiago dossier. Unless there's anything cool in this. Right, so this is the um, this, uh, Genesis 2 Chronicles 15. But that is your Santiago one. Um, let me just put a little light on it. For a lot of people, they say this is bugged, this is glitched. It's not bugged, it's not glitched, it's just they don't have the appropriate skills to open it. What you need to do is just do this. I'm HLNA, your and, holographic guide. And then this one will open for you. Literally right at the portal. This used to be where you spawned out for the boss, but it's all changed now. Huh? But I do believe that is absolutely every single dossier on Aberration. If I've missed any, do, do please feel free to put them down in the comments below. That is what they're there for. They're also there for you to like, comment and subscribe. So how about you do that? And I would like to say thank you very much. I will see you for the beta. So, ciao for now.